Hey everybody, Carbase Juice with you. Welcome. We're going to do the 2019 Bowman Hobby number nine right now. So uh, come this way. Oof, that trash can's a little bit full. I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna stick with it though. Gonna run with it. There we go. No, I mean, cause listen, I mean, this is gonna take me an hour and fifteen minutes to do. So that's gonna put me at like eight forty-five. Then I'm gonna do. I'm definitely gonna do ten, and I would like to get to jumbo. Eight done too, so I think I, I think I think I definitely at least hit hit midnight. And listen, I don't mind I don't mind staying if there's like stuff to do. KG Fowler's I mean, I don't know. Hobby has been a little bit better for us. But I don't know if I'm still like holding on to like like our er, like some of our early cases. We're just like staggeringly amazing. Not clearing it out, but I mean, I got one left in Hobby Ten that I will, you know, get rid of in some fashion. There's probably only like eight left in Jumbo Eight, which you know I will get rid of. So I mean, if something, if it's close and we can, and we can, uh, and we can move it, I'm not gonna just, you know dip so that I can go, uh, you know, lay in the bathtub and eat, eat bonbons and listen to, uh, you know, Enya. I can do that at 1 o'clock as easily as I can. Uh. Basically, Scotty, like, say I've got like a $100 team. I ask 10 people to give me $10 and then one, then I do a random and one person gets the team and then nine people get Zilch is what like a Raz is considered. I mean, way back in the day, Breakers used to do it, and like it got it got to the point that people were like doing it like for cash. This is hobby number three, no, hobby number hobby number nine. Team Butterfield. I'll get the list up for you right now. You know, you would give away like uh, everybody. Everybody gives me ten dollars, and I give one spot. You know, eighty bucks, and then I pocket twenty. Twenty from a hassle, and uh, you know, just go go about my business. Right. More Dodgers, Team Butterfield. Gotcha. More Dodgers. Um, I've got five more hobbies. On the way, Team Butterfield, that I'm gonna have to do, like I'm gonna have to do some price adjustments for. I've got right now two loose jumbos and one loose hobby that uh, I'm that I'm very seriously considering putting into like a 27 spot random teams with a fistful of combos, like 250 a spot though, and uh, like just doing like a three case three case madness uh, bit bit for that. I uh, got a gold paper for the Cubs, Keegan Thompson, and then like there's uh, kind of you know Gelfman wants to know if I want more hobbies or jumbos. Just like the I mean the, the price is significant, but it's I mean I'm not gonna you know I'll just. I will take. I'm not gonna go like nuts on nuts on prices. I mean, some squads are gonna have to get moved like up and down. Like I would definitely like after I redid it, cut cut the Blue Jays. Um, I think I'm supposed to have them like Tuesday, maybe Wednesday. So I will pro if if I get done early early ish tonight, I'll put them up tonight. Um, 
odds more likely that they'll go up like like Monday, maybe maybe Sunday. A uh, rookie of the year favorite for Christian Stewart, Atomic to one fifty. Yeah, I mean, there's just like some teams that like we've already seen have done like much better than others. So I will, you know, I will up them. Some will go down. It's just you know, it's just kind of kind of a matter of looking back at the breaks and and making reasonable adjustments to uh, teams. I mean, I can definitely email you and let you know when it uh, when it does. I emailed you today, so like, I mean, let me know if you didn't get that, like if it got kicked to spam or something, because I sent you uh, tracking on the on the, the cards, a uh, Nader Atomic for the Marlins. I do have the three cases, and if I, you know Ryan, if you're comfortable with it, then then I then I will put it up and let let Jesse uh, let Jesse do it. And Mauricio to uh, two ninety nine. I mean, I know if you I mean if you want the spots that we talked about when I put it in, I'll just take them out, and you can I mean you can you know deal with it you know later on. Like I'm not you know, you won't have to be like up to get into it or anything. Hey, Brock Burke for the Rays. Blue Refractor Autograph to 150. Okay, that's fine. I mean, I mean, if you're cool with what... I mean, the numbers that I gave you I think are pretty much what it's going to be at. So, I mean, if, for, if what you told me you would be into, I'll put you in for that and... Take care of it. That would leave Jesse with like maybe two jumbos and the multi case to try and do. And if we got an email out about the multi case, we'd probably get some uh, enough interest to have uh, all of all of in stock Bowman done by like tomorrow. No beers so far. Still have not hit a, uh, a Bart Auto, which is upsetting to me. get that changed tonight. I'm going to get that changed tonight.
Franco's been a hard one for us. I don't know why those are flipped around. Just well, we've hit a fair number of like the you know like second tier guys, like the guys you know who are considered like the three, four, five, six, seven you know prospects in this. A Helzy to uh, four ninety nine. You know, and 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 nice, nice versions of it said folks. Cole Tucker Atomic. Julio Rodriguez to uh, two hundred and fifty for the uh, Mariners. It's still just hard for me to look at uh, look at the, some of these cards and look at the birthdays and see like O one, you know, on the birthday. Like it's just it's hard. All right, orange refractor. Allow there to be ink. There is. It is a uh, Taylor a Widener for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Baseball organization. First Bowman. Uh, first Bowman guy. All right, so two for two on the uh, numbered colors. So I think we might be uh, looking at another uh, another one of these hot cases. Probably gonna have another red. Still waiting on the super. That's uh, to be yet to be pulled out of our out of our stash. We'll get that uh, shortly. Oh, the parrots are out. You know, I mean, I, we've got like a parking garage, so like I don't park outside, so I don't have to. I don't have to worry about that. But imagine there's like a tiny, like you know, outside lot, like for the bank that's here and stuff. But I'm, well, and part of them too, like the birds only really show up like around like you know dusk. I don't know where they go during the day. No, I am not a fan of birds. I like owls because they seem to be bloodthirsty killers, but you know, just birds in general, not not a huge fan.
Hey, uh, Ryland Bannon, 499 for the Orioles. A hey, uh, Impaler, Atomic. Steve, how are you doing tonight? Doing well. We got to finished off uh, all of our flawless uh, PYTs. First thing, and when I got on, got some very nice things out of that. Now I'm looking to uh, kill off these two hobby cases that I've got left in uh, PYT format. And perhaps a uh, jumbo tonight. Corey Ray to uh, 25. For the Brewers. Orange. Orange. As I, as I choose to use. And a Jonathan Hernandez. Fractor autograph for the uh, Rangers. We are three for three on numbered autos. I mean, that's what you want. You want yourself a numbered one. That's what I want. You know, when, when, I, when, I, when, I, when I go to the mall shopping for autographs, uh, just two patches. No autos. Barkley was like this was like the steal the scenes the scene stealer in it for us a Barkley book rookie book to ten a uh, encased. Glove auto to like 15 or something. Got a Carson Wentz uh, NFL Shield book 101. There's a lot of nice stuff in it. Montana uh, to three or four encased autograph. They get a nice Jim Brown auto for the Browns, though. Vikings did super, super well. Hit a uh, Darnold Jewel. Uh, in case of, like 15 auto. So that was super nice. I still got uh, uh, hit hit drafts or hit randoms uh, of it in the store. I think I got like, eight spots in uh, one and eight spots in two left right now. So I didn't know you were still here, Chris Fitz. You should have gone Jameis Winston jersey number. I guess is the only thing I can tell you. But no, I mean I was I was very impressed with uh, with, with the flaws. I mean, sometimes, like, you get, like, a whole bunch of, like, kind of, like, mid-tier, sketchy, rookie kind of stuff, you know? Like, but, I mean, there was, like, the vet stuff in it was, like, was super nice. Uh, Atomic, 
Uh, Urias? No, for uh, Tatis. Sorry, for the Padres. What am I doing? To uh, 150. But really, I mean, like, a very good names all the way around. Like, very, very happy with, uh, with, with, how, with, with how at least the flaws we had looked. Mata, Red Sox to 150. A uh, Nova Atomic. Yeah, I mean, listen, if I knew after the fact what was in uh, every box, I would, you know, I would have a, a secret name and I would buy into uh, all the breaks and get all the cool stuff and then sell it all and quit. Uh, Redemption, I'm guessing Dodgers. I'm gonna guess Dodgers because that's like the only one I've seen. And Atomic, that's uh, the uh, Atomic Variation Autos are usually to uh, 100, right? Of the Dodgers! Hey, Diego, got that! Doher's Atomic! Team Butterfield, no problem, I got you. Nice card. Yeah, he he is the only redemption that I have seen so far. Just as you tell me the Dodgers suck. You're not feeling the passion? What? It's controlled excitement tonight, JPW is what it is. It's controlled excitement. Luke and Baker to uh, 150. I don't have to get all hyped up because I know, I know I've got the hot hand. I know it's going to be magical for everyone involved in what I in what I do tonight. So I don't I don't have to I don't have to force anything right now. It's just it's just going to come. It's just going to come. Feeling good about all of it. That's true. We dad, we did have the uh the Burt Bylevin uh, redemption. You're right, Mike. You're right. Look at me all talking like smack. Now, the Kikuchi, I haven't seen. Not a single one. All right, so I can, so I can now, I can feel like a little bit, a little bit more interest, a little bit more excitement. If I end up pulling another redemption, but we are also now four for four on numbered autographs. I still wish that book had been uh, had been live. That would have been a sight to see. Ooh, JPW. I mean, I mean, if you like nice things, 
then uh, I would be happy about that. Paper for uh, Luis Garcia to 25, Washington Nationals. I know, I know, but it would, it would, just, it would have been like just a sight to see. Like I see, I, I, I'm hoping that it that they actually have it, but that it's just simply you know they just didn't put it in the in the in the set because it would have just made a mess. Libertore uh, Atomic. Because if they don't have, like, all the autographs, that might be, like, a tricky one to, like, ever get redeemed with, 20, with 24 names. Dude, uh, listen. As a Bucks fan, I can tell you that that Gruden is not a smart individual. Like he has some motivational talents. A ta another Widener, Arizona Diamondbacks, blowing this thing up. But I do not think. That's uh, he he has the current ability to uh, make it, make a good team. At least at least drafting wise. I mean, listen, I listen. I agree with the fact that that, we, that he was needed to take the Bucks to the next step after Tony Dungy. Tony Dungy had made a beautiful team, a beautiful team that just needed a spark. And needed some fire, and Gruden gave that. Then Gruden started uh, bringing in, like, he just looked at, like, an age list. Like, who's the oldest player in the NFL? I want to trade for him, and him, and him, and him. Hot mess ensues. Bucks are in the dumpster for the next, uh, you know, decade plus. I never would have left that Monday night job. I mean, I you gotta just. I mean, I, I still don't understand. A Christian Javier to uh, 250 purple refractor Astros. How you leave that job? I mean, could 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 there be anything better? And spending a couple of days, you know, maybe doing doing some interviews for upcoming Monday night game. Then just sitting in a booth and talking about the game you're watching. And then going home. That's it. Then just going home. What are you talking about, uh, JPW? I hope you are not... I'm almost taking that as a uh, sl slight on our, on our shipment speed. Unless I'm reading it wrong. Well, he's not, I mean, he's no Sean McVay. Oh, I, okay. I got you. Sorry, JPW. Sorry. Yeah, I did decide that, uh, 
I just, you know, that I was just going to uh, kick you in your groin all night long for your uh, for your cards. Sometimes I just I just get that feeling and just you know just decide there's like one guy and I'm just going to like. And it's, it's always people that I like too. You know, it's, it's never some like some rando that comes in and buys a team and something. It's always someone that I have you know an amount of respect for and you know enjoy their company that I just go like hey you know right right into your uh, right into your sack. I'm gonna just have to make like a repack product where every spot has like a card of like exact value for that spot or cumulative value so that I can do like one break at least that everyone will be will at least get what they're due for their team. I will lose money you know all the way around. That's May to uh, four ninety nine. Well, I mean, I don't know. The wallet part I do understand because you know I just do another Widener Diamondbacks on fire for this one, on absolute fire. Well, no, I mean it caught it. Mean it would cost me a small fortune to do it. Because like literally every team would have the value that they should. Then like all of a sudden people would, like, would just you know somebody would go through and like buy it all or something. I I I don't know. I mean I don't know the Gelfman. I don't think like loves the loves a lot of that stuff and. I mean, we used to do super breaks. Yeah. Colorado Rockies gold refractor autograph for Vince Fernandez. Yeah, the coalition has been uh, has been has been tough. Excellent color in this. Excellent color. Yeah, I mean, Mike, you're right about that, too. Because, I mean, there's, like, some cards that, like, I don't, you know, that I pull that I'm like, well, eh, you know, it, it, it's a fine card. You know, an okay card. And, you know, and I'll have somebody email me like, oh, thank you so much. You know, I, I, like, I've been PC in that guy since I was little. You know, or were for years or whatever, and like I, you know, that's that's the card I was looking for. You know, so I mean, so people can be happy with things that don't necessarily have like a, you know, a a dollar value. You were on Alvarez uh, Blue Shimmer to one fifty. Dude, guys, have you seen what uh, NT Basketball is selling for right now? On the uh, blowout, I don't know why that just uh, why that just made me think about it. NT Basketball is get, is getting like insane. No, Mike. I mean, if you if you could spend like full time going through like eBay auctions like you could definitely crush I mean there's a ton of players like sometimes that like I look at uh, you know I look at like sold listings like, I'm trying to price like my own thing and I'm like damn that guy got that card for that what it's 
It was like 5500 a case. The last time I looked at the uh, at the NT basketball. Dude, a, 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 there, there's going to be like a $50,000 Luca. The way like the, the way these values are running. A Spencer Dinwiddie uh, base auto, uh, like, like, like you know, auto to ninety nine uh, in that stuff is going to be like seven thousand dollars. Nah, I mean, Scotty, it just it kind of depends. It just kind of depends. Like, I mean, it's it's all about class. I mean, really? Like, if there's a if there's a huge chase guy, I mean, listen, let's be real. Like, barring like some kind of significant injury, if Zion like is what Zion looks like, next year's NT is going to be you know sixty five hundred dollars a case. Yeah, I just saw like uh, some guy Van Vanerchuk, Mike Vanerchuk. I can't remember his first name. He was on like uh, on like Rich Eisen, on the Rich Eisen show, talking about like the hobby, how he how he thinks it's like, you know, it's like it's only gonna get like bigger. He's not like a card guy in particular. But just seems to seems to think, you know, what's going on here. Uh, Ronaldo Fernandez for the Rays. Nah, that's all. I mean, that's, that you know, a break. I'd rather have a break than like a, you know, than like an ACL tear or something. That'll heal better than, you know, better than ever. Another widener. This one just a refractor, but we are looking for the, uh, oh, apparently looking at a, uh, a widener rainbow in this one. Well, yeah, I mean, that's, like, kind of what the guy was saying. That, like, he was saying, like, before the season, he bought, uh, like, went on eBay and picked up, like, 150. And, I mean, I don't, I don't, I can't even necessarily believe there was that many on there. But he, he said, like, 100 or 150, like, Giannis, you know, like, prison, like, graded prison rookies for, like, $150 a piece. And, you know, I mean, halfway through the season... And I mean, really, even end of the season, those things are, uh, you know, uh, you know, three hundred or three fifty. It's it's legit, like lotto ticket style. The only thing that he did say that I thought was just like complete garbage was he was saying like, yeah, I mean, somebody's gonna pull, you know, a ten thousand dollars Zion card out of a six dollar pack of cards, you know. And I'm like, eh, packs aren't six bucks anymore, my man. A real Muto. Ah, most still for the Marlins though here to four ninety nine. All right, Vlad upcoming in the in in box number four. The next one, number four, Evan White, Atomic. A Jonathan Hernandez for the Rangers. 
Vlad sounds about right. Sounds about right. Well, yeah, I mean, back in the day you did because they had, you know, no value. You know, but what, what's a, I mean, what is a pack of prison basketball go for now? Like 30 bucks a pack? Still hating the hobby. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna try and get a try and get a jumbo done tonight. You know, I, Mike, I don't even know. Ryan, yes, he did. I have a note that when I'm all done tonight to check and see, like I know that we shipped a bunch today, so I don't know. It might have gotten shipped to you. If it hasn't, then I will then I will switch it out. You know, I will, t I will take care of it. But I'm gonna I'm gonna have to look when I get when I get off. But yes, he he let me know. I just, I just don't know if it's been if it's been uh, mailed yet. Uh, I got an atomic coal win to uh, one fifty for the Rangers. And I got a Keegan Thompson to four ninety nine for the Cubbies. Got a uh, Daniel Johnson to uh, one twenty five for the Nationals. Orange paper for Kevin Kramer of the Pirates to 25. Some rookie pirate action. Force Whitley Atomic for the Astros. Nice for the Tigers. 22 out of 25. Sterling Auto. Casey Mize. Yeah, I mean, Ryan, I mean, I, I, t I trust. I trust Ryan enough that, uh, I mean, if he told me that a, that a deal had been done, like, I was I would believe him. Anybody else I would I would check with first, but I 
Thank you for letting me know anyway, though. Herner to two fifty for the Cubs. Purple paper. Purple paper eater. No, I me, mean, yeah, I mean listen, I mean eighty five percent of the people in here okay. Well, yeah, let's let's just say that. You know, like it tall if tall they told me that, you know, like you know, such a deal would have been made, I would, you know, trust it. Fifteen percent or so that I would uh like get a double check. And there's a fistful that I would just, you know, trust that I just trust explicitly about it. Hundred and thirty seven Smokey Jenkins. I mean that's it seems seems low. If you really want to maximize you got you gotta buy close to two hundred teams. I mean, I could give you like a rough number. Well, you know what? Actually, I might. Eh. I could give you like a pretty, a, probably a pretty accurate number if I. Mm. Yeah, I mean, it would take me a little bit, but I could probably get you a rough number. I mean, I think we still keep like most of our break sheets all on one Google page. A uh, Christian Javier to one twenty five for the Astros. So it might be as simple as like a Control F. Well, see, like I don't know how far back that goes. Or, like, sometimes, like, this year's Bowman, like, I put on a separate sheet, like, just to keep it, like, all all together. A Chavez to uh, $2.99 for the Red Sox. So, it might be... You know, the, the next day that I that I have nothing to do, I will work on that. Lasagia to $4.99 for the Yankees. Hey, uh, Julio Rodriguez, uh, Atomic. I don't know. Listen, we, we, I've got some. Uh, I got some ho some high profile people here, like legit, like Hollywood actor types that uh, don't that have, that have like permanently requested that their name not be put on a on a sheet. You know, so that uh, they don't get like you know hassled if they you know come into the chat or something. 
for reals. So I don't, you know, so I can't do that. Dom Thompson Williams, rare Yankee business. Ryan, what? That I mean, it still it still haunts me to this day. I will never live it down from Bateson, or never be able to let it go. That stupid uh, Babe Ruth baseball that uh, that went to somebody that didn't even buy a spot in a break because of because of me. Ugh. I still get hate mail on that sometimes. Get it back? Yeah, then the then the one on one messy the next day. Yeah. I have not seen him in like in a year, if if not more. No, Joe. I mean, he he legit won the ball. I mean, it just like I used to like when I was only on breakers. Breakers has like this very easy like chat command that just like gives you like a random person that's in the room. And on Fridays, I would do like a free stuff Friday, like that. Like that was like my big promotion. And like every so often, I would, uh, you know, say like, "All right, if you're in the room and you're here and you can chat," because at the time, like I just I wanted like people to to be there to talk and stuff, and like hopefully then like it, you know, it's, it's the whole thing. So like I would throw down the tr the random command. A name would pop up. I'd be like, "Okay, is uh, Joe? Are you here?" Because a lot of people would just like you know be in the room, but not like like be really in the room. And if you were there, I would I would give away like spots and breaks or break credit or whatever. And this guy got gave away a spot in a in a break that happened to be like a pro a promo break for this like huge thing that we were doing at National, selling twenty fifteen. Top Supreme football. The best football that probably ever existed. And so he gets the free spot from the from like the free stuff Friday giveaway. Then after the break's over, we do random. Like one person out of that break gets put in like the next, you know, major giveaway. He gets he wins that, he gets that spot. And then we go to national. And do the huge, like, I mean, it was me and the Jaspies and Bates, like, all doing, like, this thing. Like, so all three of us like, had, like, you know, hundreds of names in this thing to give away a Babe Ruth autographed baseball. And, uh, sure as hell enough, he, uh, this guy that got the Free Stuff Friday spot, that, uh, then got the, you know, Got a thing. Win, wins the ball. I mean, he. T I mean, he had bought spots. You know, like it, it, he wasn't like a complete freeloader, but he was. Oh, I mean, he was such a was such an a hole. Bateson actually had him banned from his room. Like, he wasn't even allowed to be in, in his room because he talked, like, so much crap and told Bateson he was going to kill him one time. So he, 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 couldn't even, he couldn't even go in that room. But, I mean, he was like, he's like a, like a 16-year-old Swedish kid or Norwegian kid or something. Who would always just, like, come in and be like, oh... You know, do you guys know how to get, uh, you know, blood out of blood out of sheets or something? Like, you know, you know, I, you know, I had to beat up this guy yesterday for, 
you know, talking bad about this girl and, you know, now, you know, now my sheets are all bloody and I don't want my parents to know or like, oh, you know, I just, just got, I'm so wasted. I just got back, you know, from the, you know, from the club. I, I can't even see. I'm so torn up. Granted, like perfect English. I mean, this guy was like typing. So there's no way he was like, you know, wasted. He just, all he did was talk smack. All he did was talk smack. Everybody hated him. A uh, canary yellow refractor for uh, Reggie Lawson. Padres. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm, I will probably hear about that then. Uh, what was that? What was his name? What was his name? Uh, Marte Atomic. Chris Fitz, you got to remember. Yeah, yeah, Tristan McKenzie to four ninety nine. Grismas, Grismas, Degrom and KG Fowler. That's thank you, Chris Fitz. Yeah, I think I still have him. If if I have not deleted WhatsApp, like he was on my uh, on my on my WhatsApp at, at one point. Oh, he was such a just such an a hole. Everything was a lie. Like it just everything that came out of his mouth. A studio to uh, one fifty for the twins. Really, I mean, base didn't base didn't just just or not even base, but somebody just didn't straight ban him. I don't know. Bates is like, you know, it, it kind of depends on the mood you catch him in. You know, like I, I, I've seen him make people cry. Brady Singer Royals. Sparkle Dust autographed to 299. I'm sure he's still in the system. Like I might be able to find him and like track down his social media, see if he's still on the uh, Twitter or whatnot. And they have Mitch Keller to 499 for the Pirates. <laughs> All right, so, so then he was, I mean, I, don't, I guess he was in an okay mood. He's been, I don't know, he, he's been putting in a lot of hours. Here recently, so I know I know he's about half dead. Well, hello, Derek. How's it going? No, I know. Just just I know this, Joe. Everybody knows this, but uh, I don't. You know, I, I don't say it to his face. No, Steve, I'm always gentle. Jesse's the one that you got to worry about being rough. You know, with him, Rip City after dark, after dark starts at uh, the second that he you know, goes live. You'll always be gentle. God, it's killing me that I cannot remember that, that guy's actual name. Yeah, I don't know. Jesse's a little bit too a little bit too over the top for me, personally. 
Like I know that there's I know there's people that quit quit watching because they have like kids and stuff that uh kids that, that used to watch. I know what it is. See if anybody can find this guy uh, on uh, on on social media while you're uh, you know while you're hanging out. He is from Sweden. Storbersvagen twenty seven is uh is his street address if he if he still lives there. That's the guy that uh, we're talking about from the old from the old days. Ruiz to four ninety nine. I don't know how it how it just came to me. Keegan Thompson Atomic. Yeah, uh, JPW is that everywhere where you every every spot you were in, I put like a little. Uh, Annotation like off to the side. You can't see it because I cut it off. But every spot you were there, I just put like negative one for uh, potent for potential card hit. Negative two on a couple of your teams, which was m maybe a little bit, uh, you know, much much on my end. But to one twenty-five, a uh, Luciano for the Giants. Is it this kid's actually eleven years old? He actually he he just got potty trained like uh, like two years ago from what I from what I understand. Moncada to four ninety nine White Sox. You know, it, it just it's random, JPW. Really, it's not. I don't personally do it. It's just purely random. So, like, I don't know if you didn't. You know, like if you saw like some old lady trying to get across the street and just you know instead of helping her, like you know kicked her cane out of her uh, hand or something. But the random gods were not uh, pleased with what whatever you'd done yesterday. 11 out of 25, top 100 force. Willie, number 5 for the Astros and the orange variation. I don't know. Did you, did you curse Bowman or something at some point? Like... A Vince Fernandez Rockies purple! Again, we are seeing a lot of these, uh, you know, one player, one team, like really just walking away with this. Wait, which dude, Joe? That Luciano cat's like 17 years old. Oh, Fernandez, yeah, I mean, I mean he, yeah, I don't, uh, I don't doubt that.
Yeah, born in 95. He's old. He's old. He probably went to school for four years to get, like, an education. So far, a very nice case, color-wise. Some people did very well. Others got uh, completely shat upon. Yeah, I mean, that's basically all I got left. I mean, I've got uh, two hit randoms for Flawless Football. If anybody's interested in that, the last time I looked at that, there was uh, eight left in each of those. Guaranteed uh, hit. Could be one of the three in case. Could be one of the seven uh, box cards. All many fancy things. Only 180 bucks. Which what, with what we pulled out of it, like seven guys are going to like crush that thing to death uh, at that price. Um, And then, I mean, again, there's one left in, like, Bowman 10. I mean, I can put, I'll put it in, I'll put it in in between this two. It's not, it shouldn't be a, a difficult addition. I mean, I, I mean, I don't know, I think, like, 20, 27. I can probably combo up, combo up enough that, like, for 27, it's just, it's like, it's how many, like, whether it be 20. 26 or 27 in, in the combo spot. A Duggar to 250 for the Giants rookie business. Two Jumbo, one Hobby, random teams. If I end up doing it at like 27 spots with combos, would be like a 249 and 99. I, that, I, see, that I don't know. I mean, that I'd have to look at. Uh, Quantrill, Atomic. I mean, Red Sox uh, traditionally get no love in any of this. Kevin Smith to 125 refractor. And a Logan Webb San Francisco Giants autograph. Maybe I'll just leave it like uh, to be determined. Another orange for Franklin the Kaloom. 25. Orange shimmeriness. Now this is like the like orange wise back to what we were pulling like early on release day. Lots of orange. Lots of fancy hotness. A uh, K to uh, 250. The problem with that, JPW, like, would just be having everybody here at the at the time to be able to do it. Like, it would be epic and beautiful. I just don't know that I could that I could manage getting like everybody involved in at the time to do it. I mean that. I mean, unless you, unless it was just done like as a straight like filler break, you know. That would be the. Only, I mean, it could it couldn't go in the store. Yeah, but I don't. Know, we haven't done. We haven't done a random teams break in uh, in ages. In just ages.
I mean, if you want to do the three cases and an eight-man snake draft, like that's, that's going to be uh, it's going to be pricey. It's not going to be cheap. All right, so we have got a Logan Webb for the San Francisco Giants, a Vince Fernandez purple for the Rockies to two fifty, a Brady Singer to two ninety nine Sparkle Dust for the Royals. Dom Thompson Williams for the Yankees, a Jonathan Hernandez for the Rangers, a Widener for the Diamondbacks, the uh, Atomic uh, variation for the Dodgers, a Diego Ricarte, uh, Jonathan Hernandez refractor autograph for the Rangers, a uh, Brock Burke for the Rays to uh, 150, pure blue. Then we had uh, Casey Mize uh, to 25. Uh, Platinum on card, even a uh, Vince Fernandez in gold uh, for the Rockies to 50, and a Widener uh, orange 25 for the time back. So, thank you, everybody. We're gonna fit a two.